I'm laying here with my boy. It is the morning of November 1st, and it is time for the Tech 9 experience with Hollywood Undead, but not just any Tech 9 experience with Hollywood Undead. I'm going to be meeting Tech 9 in person and also watching Hollywood Undead. I'm about to get up. I need to get up. I should take a shower or a bath. It's so freaking cold outside. It's 19 degrees outside right now. 19 Fahrenheit. You could do the Celsius math. I can't. Then I'm going to let Rocky outside real quick, and then I'm going to get ready for a bath. I'm very surprised that my dog hasn't noticed these dudes yet. There's another one over there. You can't really tell, but he's there. I'm surprised Rocky hasn't seen them yet. As soon as he sees them, he's going to lose his shit. All right. Now it's time for the early morning coffee. Oh, I don't drink a lot of coffee, but goddamn, that makes your stecker peck out. I, need, I needed a coffee because uh, I need to wake my ass up a little bit more. I'm still a little bit like, oh my god, I'm drowsy. Brought my buddy his coffee, and we're about to leave here soon. He's just getting a shower and getting some clothes in the wash. Oh, dude. Bruh. Ready to choke the chicken? <laughs> but yeah, I'm just waiting on him to get done with his stuff and then we're about to go. It's just really cold. I didn't really want to wait outside, but it's also really cold in here too because no heat is running, which there's no need for any heat to run right now in here. But yeah, it's just a little cold. Oh, dude, I got this. The Spider-Man Edition PS5. Like, I saw the box, but I didn't know he actually unboxed it. That is so cool. I like that. And also, it's not a sponsor thing, but I figure he's helped me out, especially on my YouTube journey as well. So uh, the least I can do is try and help him out. If you guys want to check him out, his whatnot link will be down in the description. Basically, he just goes on there and sells games. Um, I promoted it before. Last year, I think I promoted it. You know, he, he does very well. He has all sorts of equipment. He can fix up games. He just sells games and just some other stuff that people may be interested in. Um, he tries to ship everything out basically next day or just as soon as possible, depending on how everything goes. He also works his own job too. So whatnot is just basically a side gig. But if you guys are interested, um, I'll leave the link down to his whatnot in the description. And then if you guys want to purchase anything, then you can go on over there. Be cordial in the chat. Like, I'm, I'm also saying this because I know me on YouTube and him on whatnot are completely different worlds. Like, he's not interested in Skibbity Toilet. He's not interested in Roblox. He's not interested in any of that. He's just there to sell stuff. So if you do happen to come over, please don't spam his chat with like Skibbity Toilet and all this other stuff because he does very well. He's a lot more successful at what he's doing here compared to what I'm doing on YouTube. So <laughs> just be cordial, be respectful, you know, just, be nice oh my goodness this is really weird <laughs> god i hope this is working too all right welcome to the tech nine unboxing i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys basically everything that i got that something i will put on uh words i'm gonna show you basically everything that i got from my buddy for the tech nine show and i'm probably gonna put one of these things on anyway but for starters tech nine Shirt. This is probably the shirt that I'm going to be wearing there because why not? Of course, it's going to be cool. And then I got the gray. Very nice. Very nice indeed. I got me a Strange Music water bottle. Hell yeah. I'll definitely use the shit out of that. By the way, all this Tech 9 stuff is mine. I'm sorry. I will never part ways with it. <laughs> I don't care how much you pay me. And then we got some pins and a lanyard. Strange Music lanyard. Strange Music! That was cringe. I'm sorry. And then I also got a flag with the Tech 9 pledge on it, which it's probably not really viewed real well in the camera, but yeah, I'm, I'm very happy <laughs> that I got all this. We've been talking about it for a while that I needed to get the stuff from him, but I've been so busy and I hadn't been able to make my way out this way to actually get it. So I, I got all sorts of cool stuff and I'm so happy about it. I'm so happy. I've been seeing Tech 9. I think this is probably like my fourth or fifth time seeing Tech 9, but now it's in person. And so I, I'm happy to be decked out. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and change into this black shirt real quick before he comes out. Dude, pretty, pretty big. But I mean, he, he and I were the same size basically. So I mean, either I'm gonna get really fat and grow into it 
or I'm just going to have to deal with it, which I'm just going to deal with it. <laughs> I don't give a shit. <laughs> this day just keeps getting better and better. This is a weekday also. So, I mean, holy crap, I could be working right now and instead I'm seeing Tech Night. <laughs> also, I almost completely forgot, but I also got some decals and stuff that I may actually put on my car. So, Tech Nine will be riding with us all the way to Oklahoma. That is so cool. At some point, I'm going to put this up in my room. I don't know exactly where because in my background, it's usually just a window, but I'll figure it out. Well, we made it. Jack in the box, let's go. Yeah. Got the Jack in the box tendies. I'm, I'm still kind of scared for the car though. <laughs> Bessie, it's okay. Just don't get scared. Rims are optional, right? <laughs> I need everything to stay intact with this car. We just went to a quick trip and the <laughs> The, the bathrooms are closed from 11 to 5. You need a key card to get in there. A lot, lots of people out on, on the street. <laughs> like, I, I'm actually... Well, I mean, it, like I said, it could be a lot worse, but I, I'm still a little frightened. I'm still a little scared what we're going to come out to. All right, Jack in the Box, how are your tendies? Hmm? Tastes no. like Arby's. Yeah. It's just a generic tendies. Yeah. It's literally like an Arby's. But yeah, you, you got the curly fries. I did. And the n n attendees <laughs> from Arby's. <laughs> I got that spicy good good sauce though. It's pretty good. Oh man, it's not bad. They forgot the tacos. Yeah, we're very upset. They forgot our tacos. You know what? That guy wanted you to come back. Now and we gotta go back and see him. No, no, not because he forgot our tacos. Now we don't go back. Now we gotta go to a different Jack in the Box and tell him about the experience. <laughs> I don't know if I'll be able to record seeing tech like in person but we we'll probably come out with a good picture i don't know i'm just so excited oh it's definitely gonna be fun you, you got the tickets right so anyway i'm gonna be out in the car listening <laughs> <laughs> he's seen him six times and then a passing glance <laughs>
Welcome to my purgatory party, baby. They say it ain't nothing but farms where we from. They think we can't do no one harm where we from. Speakers, 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 speakers. Speakers. Uh, I didn't really record last night because I was so tired. But it was fun. It was a great time. I also have a, another video that I'm thinking about making now. It's a little story time about what happened at the Dick Night Show. It was wonderful. It's a great way to end my concert going time for this year. Thank you, Tech, for always putting on a great show. King Iso, you did great as well. Um, there was a local band from Tulsa that was playing. Y'all did great. Freaking Hollywood Undead. Phenomenal. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.